So um, I would say that over 95% of the client and company clients use some form of Intuit software, whether that's a QuickBooks Pro, a QuickBooks Premier, or a QuickBooks Enterprise. Uh, and if you each have your handout, I did do a summary, a comparisons of the, um, the different types of, uh, of uh, QuickBooks out there. Now, I did put QuickBooks Online on here because I would suspect that most government contractors, when they begin, they see QuickBooks Online and um, it's a free trial, so they generally uh, start with this program. For those of you who know me, and there is a few in this room, which is great, um, I, am, I am not in favor of a QuickBooks Online version. Um, although the QuickBooks Online is very convenient in that all you need is an internet connection, um, it really is not user friendly, <coughs> it is not smooth, and most importantly, it is not compliant with the federal acquisition regulations or FAR. So if you do have a QuickBooks Online software, and you have firm fixed price, sure it is compliant, but if you go on to, to a, a cost reimbursable project, uh, then QuickBooks Online is not sufficient for you. So I would uh, strongly recommend that for contractors beginning, you would go with the QuickBooks Pro. Um, it is a desktop version, for every computer that you want to put the QuickBooks on, you will need a license. Um, or if you have a server, then, then one license should be sufficient. Uh, but if you want multiple people on the same QuickBooks file, you will need multiple licenses. Okay? So um, if you want to just uh, see yourself the review uh, for QuickBooks, again, QuickBooks Online, you can certainly look at that yourself. There is three levels of QuickBooks Online. I really don't want to emphasize it because I don't think it's the software for government contractors. Uh, but the QuickBooks Pro, uh, for the use, it's normally around $200. And um, the users is three. When it says three, that means three people working at the same time on the same file. Uh, it does have the ability to email your invoices, your quotes, your, uh, your uh, statements. Uh, it does do payroll and I will get into that in a few moments. Uh, the reports for the QuickBooks Pro are limited, and as you grow, that may be an issue for you. Um, it does download banks and credit cards, and again, I will go into details about that. It does do budgets, but like all QuickBooks programs, it does have limitations, uh, and it does not track inventory. So again, with the Premier, uh, more expensive, $350. Again, five users simultaneously. It does do the, uh, you can email your invoices, your quotes. It does do payroll. It does have much better reports than Pro. It can download the bank statements and your credit cards. It does do budgets, but again, it is limited and you, it cannot track your inventory. Well, what, what, it doesn't track the inventory the way you would do the FIFO or the LIFO. You can put the inventory in, but you can't track it FIFO or LIFO. Right. Okay. Uh, QuickBooks Enterprise, of course, is a much more expensive uh, software. Uh, uh, and again, it can have 30 users working on the same file at the same time. And of course, it's yes to all the other requirements. It is the beefy uh, QuickBooks. Uh, the advantage with the Intuit programs is that um, as you grow, the Intuit programs will grow with you. So you can start off with the Pro. If you have two or three, we say, employees. But if you grow to 40, 50 employees, the enterprise uh, will be uh, more than sufficient to, uh, to do what you need to do.